smoking good to play in front of you. Today has been such a shitty day for us. I know there were some rumors going around that we're not going to be here. But we're fucking here, alright? Oh yeah, baby. If you know the words, I would love to hear you sing it as I am locking another singer on this tour. This song we haven't played in a while, and it goes by the song title, White Flag.
and it feels fucking good to be up here. Take a quick second to fill you in on a little bit of glass cloud information. As you can see, we have another guy sitting down behind the drum set. We have another guy over here that's playing the drums. I don't know if anybody has like social media or Twitter or Facebook or anything like that. I know it's 2014 and that's probably old news now. But uh, a few like a month ago, we had some member changes within our band. Nothing, nothing bad. We just had to have, let a couple of our buddies go. It was a mutual agreement. Those are still our brothers, and we love them. They got some new shit coming out. It's fucking awesome. Yeah. Think about that is that we had two people that claimed that they could fill in. They claimed and fucking poured their heart to me over the phone, and they fucking showed up at my house at July 1st. And they were fucking shot. They were not good. They were not all they claimed to be. So, I didn't care as long as they would just practice and pour their heart into it. That's all that I ask. Then said, I went to my front porch and they were getting in a cab. And they said, sorry, it's not going to work out. And they just fucking drove away. Fuck them. I know our music is really easy to play. <laughs> so that left us about a week ago with no drummer, no bassist, no nothing. They cried to me and said how much so they didn't want to leave us high and dry. But I fucking said that's what you're doing, you fucking bitch. I don't want to name names because I don't want to even give them the fucking time of day. So let them just go off and be punk bitches where they want to go. As far as that, we reached all of our ends of the music industry. But we have a couple of our good buddies that are filling in on the drums. I need you guys to realize that these guys flew in last minute, up and left their lives, broke their leases, quit their jobs to come out and pour their fucking heart out. If that's not dedication, I don't know what the fuck is. We brought our homies out because they're our buddies and we fucking love them. And they said that they will help us out. That's all that I ask. So all that I ask from you is just to empathize. That means put yourself in our shoes and realize it was either cancel this entire tour or come up here and just have a fucking good time. I'm not one to fucking cancel shows, so we're here. Another funny thing about that is that before we found anybody, Joshua here was going to play the drums on this tour. <laughs> realize that Josh Travis here wrote all the drums. Yeah. So we can play that shit. But then it would just be me up here and that'd be awkward. Because I'm obviously not very good talking right now. Unless I'm screaming, I'm shot up here. But I thank you guys for enjoying it, if you are. And for those of you who left, eh, I don't care. <laughs> <laughs>